See, we will understand about what is power and we have done some numericals on it. Every day, you consume so much of electricity and you wanted to know that how much of electricity consumed, then when one month, one month is finished, you will get electricity bill and that mentioned that 320 units, 420 units like that and based on units, they will calculate the amount of money you have to pay and that amount you are, you are going to pay to the, in the electricity department, to the electricity department. Now my question is that, how they will calculate the amount of money with respect to the number of units you have consumed or how do you know that uh, how much of units you have consumed, how much of electric, electrical energy you have used. And if you want to know that, yes, you have a solution in physics. Concentrate. Electrical energy consumption. We know that power P equal to energy by time implies energy E equal to power into time and this energy is electrical energy. If you know the power and time, you can find electrical energy. For example, see the example. You have taken an electric bulb of power 40 watts and used for used for 10 hours then the electrical energy electrical energy consumed is how much see you have power into time no? power into time so power is 40 watts and time is 10 hours then you can say 400 watt hour Okay, but there is a change in this value. Generally, electrical energy consumption shown in terms of units. One unit of electric electricity consumption equal to 1 kWh, kilowatt hour. One unit equal to 1 kWh. So, if you take, go back to this numerical, 400 watt hour is nothing but you should convert into kilowatt hours. So to convert kilowatt hours means you should have K here. So what I do, I write 400 kWh by K. So values do not change. But what is K? K means 1000. So 400 kWh by 1000. So two zeros, two zeros cancel. I write 0.4 kwh or I can say 0 0.4 units see you got it so if you use the electric bulb of this much of power for 10 hours the amount of units you have consumed is 0 0.4 and remember this conversion see one unit equals to one kilowatt hour I told you but Generally, we when we talk about energies, we show the energy value in terms of joules. Now, you may got doubt that one kilowatt hour equal to how many joules? Let, let, let us see the board. One kWh equal to one kilowatt means thousand into one hour. One hour, sixty minutes. One minute, sixty seconds. So, sixty into sixty seconds. 1 hour is converted into 60 into 60. So therefore, you can write 6, 6, 36 into or 36 into 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 5 zeros. Therefore, you can I can say 3.6 into 10 power 6 joules is what 1 kWh is. So this is a very big number. So in electricity bill, if the person gives the amount of energy consumed in terms of this number, it is very difficult to remember, very difficult to manipulate it. That's why what the scientist told that convert this 36,000 joules into 1 kWh and take 1 kWh as 1 unit of consumption. And hence, we have done this numerical and we have shown the amount of energy consumption in terms of units.